Good morning. It's Monday assembly and today I thought I'd be outside. It's only just warm enough and that's why I've got a nice warm jumper on. But yesterday, Sunday, I spent a lot of time in my garden, gardening. It's not something I usually do and my poor garden knows it. But <clears throat> I spent a lot of time looking after um, some plants and a pond and it made me notice some really small things that are changing and I couldn't help but think that this strange time when we're not at school is actually a really good time because it's spring and wherever you are whether you've got a garden or not there are so many small things that you can notice changing you can notice birds coming past maybe you could even try and work out which ones they are in our garden we're lucky that we have quite a lot of birds that visit and I thought I would try and work out what some of those birds are. I'm not very good on knowing bird names. But you could also look at plants and you could see what you can notice, what's changing, new leaves and buds that are growing and take real enjoyment in change because everything is changing at the moment. Big things are changing and small things are changing. And by noticing the small things that are changing, we can see that the seasons move on and change will happen and we won't be in this very bizarre time forever. So enjoy some of the small changes and I'll try and show you some here. <clears throat> this is one of my favourite plants in our garden. This is an Acer. And at the moment the buds are just appearing and making this beautiful pink colour. You can see them swaying in the breeze. But they'll change and they'll change from pink to yellow and then to green in a while. And down lower there are some daffodils growing, little tiny ones. And they couldn't find much light the other day.